Welcome to a video from the digitalized.com. New Windows 10 build to look at. This is 18252 for Windows Insiders on the fast ring and skip ahead. Now that Redstone 5, the October 2018 update is completed, Microsoft are putting the 19H1 builds out for fast ring as well as skip ahead. So here you can see uh, 18252, this came down uh, skip ahead and fast ring options right so what's changed in this bit there's a couple of minor changes with this build here you can see there's a new microphone icon showing you when your microphone's in use which is quite a good idea i guess for privacy reasons you can see which it's, it's been used and it's in use now because i'm recording the this uh, video so that's new the other thing that and so it was new is you can now in settings put your IP address settings where previously you'd have to go into control panel in fact probably the easiest way is to go into network settings that way so here I'm going to go into IP addresses it's on DHCP at the moment but I can set it to manual if I set it to manual turn on v4 I can then type in my IP address whatever that should be and you can put in your uh, subnet mask your gateway and your 2 dns settings and you can also enter the um, ipv6 settings in there as well so no need to dig around in control panel anymore which is good to see um, the thing better the more that comes out of control panel and into one location like settings is good you should see it then it uh, I think it crashed settings then actually but anyway there you go I've put my IP address in so those were the two visible changes there's another change which I can show you is the network icon changes uh, other thing I can show you is the network change, icon changes like that uh, to show the connection status now we're connected it's all fine but if it was offline it would show with a, that circle with a little sort of uh, cross on it to show that there's no uh, connection like there you go a little cross there you can see at the bottom because uh, I've put it onto a network that has no connection there are a couple of other changes some extra language supports they um, they fixed some the issue with task manager where the icon was blinking let me show you so this was blinking and flashing on the previous build, including the release build actually. Um, they fixed that. Um, they fixed the task manager reporting of the um, issues as well. With the, they fixed task manager reporting the performance issues as well. They've fixed some issues with dark mode where it had a thick border. I showed that on my previous video actually. If I right click on a file, it had a big white border down there. That's been fixed. And um, they fixed the issues with Windows Hello not working as well. There are some known issues. Uh, the settings that may crash, as you see. Uh, there's some issues with logging in, and there's um, some of the inbox apps may not work, work correctly. There's a link on the Microsoft Answers form if you do get that problem. So those are the main changes with this build. We're now moving on to this uh, 19H1, which means uh, 2019 H1 half first half of 2019 hopefully we'll get the tablet explorer coming back in this build and uh, in, in this release and some other new features so look forward to those you can follow on our youtube channel or you can go on at iStix on twitter on the digitallifestyle.com thanks for watching